Helena Lisak. Ukraine. Gambarova, Azerbaijan. Bronze medal, first of two coming at 59 kilos. Had a chance to watch both of Lee Sachs' matches yesterday, and she's a good young wrestler. Chance to get a senior medal for the first time at these European Championships. In the blue, representing Ukraine. Can they go three for three and wins in this no evening session? No finger blue. Couple of gold no now trying to earn a bronze. So get a quick whistle. You saw Lisak shaking that right hand, trying to clear those fingers. Gambarova. On top thread. Think about Lisak, she looks like a smaller 59. Smaller in stature than her opponent, Gambarova. You mentioned Ukraine's two championships. They are currently in the lead at 50 points. Bulgaria in second with a pair of silver medals, so they have 40 points. Turkey in third with their pair of bronze medals. So they have 30. Belarus with 25 and Romania with 25. That rounds out the top five. And if you're unfamiliar with the scoring system, a gold medal will get you 25 points. A silver medal will get you 20. A bronze medal will get you 15. And then a fifth place finish will give your team 10 points. So we're really seeing a contrast from what happened last year at these European Championships with some of those teams. Russia obviously dominated last year, 173. Belarus at 140. So Ukraine and Bulgaria. Bulgaria finished in the fifth spot. Ukraine was not in the top six. So what a difference a year makes. Yeah, and Ukraine, when you ask me what, who are some surprises, Ukraine has really showed up. And not only did they show up yesterday, but they also did so today. A couple of wrestlers wrestling again for another opportunity to reach the top of the podium here at the Continental Championships. It's right across the face, that was nasty. Yeah, you're you're going to see that face of Lisak turn real red real quick if that would have been allowed to continue. Around the throat and moved up around the mouth area. Uncomfortable, that's for sure. Lisak, though, leading 4-2 for Ukraine. More than two minutes into this first period. No I really like the look of the white socks with the white shoes. I wasn't so fond of it a couple of years ago, but it's really grown on me. Contact blue. Hey, you don't see that combination too often. Central. That's it. Oh, beautiful executed throw for two. Trading throws, it was Lezak in the opening Break. two minutes, picking up the four point throw. No, that wasn't a okay. four point throw. Still two points will bring it to 4-4 after the first three minutes. That's when you try that type of throw. You know that clock's winding down, it's tough to hit. The arm toss, but she trapped that arm and okay, timed time. it beautifully with the end of the period. This was early activity in the first period. Lee Sack coming out on top in that exchange. But she did not come out on top with that one. And as a result, we're tied moving into the second and final period. Deadlocked at four. Lee Sack's with the criteria because of that four pointer. Talk about throws. Might as well mention that the brackets for Greco Roman 55, 63, 77, 87, and 130 are up on United World Wrestling's Twitter and Facebook. So head on over and check out those brackets. 
Russia brings five returning champions, two Olympic gold medalists, and then Alexander Komarov at 87 kilos will make his senior level European championship debut. He's a four-time world champion at the age group level. So they're stacked, and that kicks off tomorrow. Look forward to the Greco-Roman style tomorrow night. I know you're a big fan of Greco. That's I your... am. Crank it up a couple of notches tomorrow night. 6-4, two minutes to go. Azerbaijan has rallied to take the lead. Morova. She has matched Lee Sack's firepower in this bronze medal bout. Both have went with those arm throws. We've seen both come away with points with that particular style. You know Lee Sack's going to keep coming. Time she nearly got too high as Gabarova swiveled her way around. The referee's telling Gabarova pick her head up, but if she does, then she's going to get thrown. So she's OK with just keeping her hips back and head down. Yeah, yeah Lee Sack is just waiting, patiently waiting, keeping that over on that left side, hoping that her opponent makes that fatal mistake, and she did not, to her credit. Lee Sack, though, was able to get two, countered with a one by Gambarova. Right back across that face. Yeah, she goes to that. You're not going to win a lot of friends with your opponents doing that. You're going to beat the heck out of them doing it, that's for sure, and wear them out. But see the facial reaction there from Lee Sack, just trying to get some air. You don't want to be underneath this wrestler. Another throw, headlock, scissored up, locked up defensively by Lisak. She needs to keep it clinched, otherwise she'll give up the two. And she does, so Gambarova putting up nine with 30 seconds to go. Action. At time and time again. Surprised the referees are allowing her to come across the face like that, but Lisak hasn't really taken an opportunity to get to the legs. It's all upper body. So Gambarova, see her just keeping her hips back. Just, as you mentioned, staying patient. Lee Sack was in desperation mode. She knew she had to just throw everything at her opponent. Gambarova does not get two, it's a slip. She was not the offensive wrestler there, but she will celebrate a bronze medal and ends up with nine, so a 9-6 win. Azerbaijan, a bronze medal, and they, they stop the UK run of two in a row.